Brilliant. Hello lads, welcome back to the channel. My name's Alad for Set Play Gaming, and uh, here we have the Stevenage Road to Glory career mode with AD Booth, right? And we've got episode 4. Uh, if you've missed any of the other episodes, there is a link to the playlist in the description for you down below. Go back and watch those. Uh, help my channel out tremendously. And uh, I'd just like to say thank you to everybody so far who has watched the episodes. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments so far. Coming up in today's episode, we're going to be playing a league game. And we're going to be playing Grimsby Town. So without further ado, let's see how we get on. So today's game is Grimsby Town at home and we return back to Broad Hallway uh, to take on Grimsby after our cup exploits against Peterborough. And here's our lineup to today. It's pretty much unchanged. There isn't anybody really there uh, who's out of place. Uh, we've got Jake Taylor holding the midfield today with Reeves and Gilby in midfield. So a little bit industrious but obviously enough creativity there to get uh, creative and hopefully provide some chances for those uh, front two of Luke Norris and Jamie Reid. Uh, looking at the Grimsby Town lineup, I don't see many there that really stand out. I don't see any danger men really. Um, we really should bank um, a home win. As Grimsby Town get us underway, they're not playing in the black and white stripes today. They're playing in a change trip. It looks like an away strip of blue, all blue. And uh, start there. Good pressure that from Taylor early on. And we win the ball back. And uh, Piagiani plays it wide. I'm going to cut inside here. Oh, it's a strong tackle by the fullback. Lofted over into Clark. And he'll cut inside. It's Gilby into Norris. Good hold up play. Norris back to Gilby. Oh, good early chance. And look at Boothroyd. That has to be on target from Alex Gilby. Back to Van Kooten. Back inside, Taylor. That's the one advantage to having Taylor is that he is a bit more mobile than um, Bostwick. Back inside, it's Reed. Oh, good save by the goalkeeper. And an earlier infringement brought back by the referee, Brendan Kiernan, with the foul. We won't look at it. Intercepted there is Kiernan. Is and now Grimsby putting on the pressure. Oh, and he just about to get that away. Reeves does well to get the flick on. Norris. Back to Reeves, and this is a good run. He's continued. He's running to the box. And there's Jamie Reed. Come on, lads. It's 1-0. And Jamie Reed. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Jamie Reed. And that was really, really good play. Yeah, it's an easy finish in the end. Jamie Reed. One goal in two matches. His first league goal of the season. Well won by... Sweeney, Reeves, back inside Norris, back across, just before half time here it's Gilby, and now here comes Clark, great opportunity, that's a great ball in, yes, come on, and it's Luke Norris again, it is 2-0, just before half time, and that is a trademark goal. For Luke Norris, edge of the six yard box, rose like a salmon, and there it is, in the back of the net. A wonderful cross from Clark as well. Oh, and Piagiani loses possession there, he's run off the ball, and a great chance here, Peppel! Oh, is that a save? What a chance that was, and a warning there for Stevenage. It's not a save, it's... Oh, it's fractionally wide. Lucky not to go and concede a goal there just before half-time. But we do go in at the break. That is half-time, it's 2-0. And goals from Reed and Norris. Just as I said, um, our midfield seems to be winning the battle at the minute. But just got a err on the side of caution there. A 
a little bit of a warning towards the end of that first half. Can't be complacent. And they do look one of the weaker sides for be in this league. So we should be winning a game like this. Especially if we have aspirations of wanting to get promoted. And I'm sure AD Boudreaux and everybody watching is going to want that. Guys, just to let you know, um, I'm going to be leaving in the comments. I'm going to be leaving a, a little link. Um, if you missed episode before this, you can just click on that, go back and watch it. Helps out my channel tremendously. Um, and I appreciate, obviously, all the, the um, support and encouragement you guys are giving. Oh, early, another chance here. But he's lashed that wide, and I think the defender did enough. It's a new series, and lots of optimism about the work on the channel. I want to try and get to 250 subscribers. Oh, look at that. Oh, that was a great corner. Delivered to the six-yard box front post. And I think it's Sweeney, you know, with the header. We're just going to make a change here. Um, I didn't show it on camera, but Clark did pick up a knock. So a gunbow's going to come on here at left back. Uh, just to give him sort of 20, 30 minutes run out. Especially against a weaker opposition. A strong tackle there by the forward. Taylor lost out. But yeah, um, I don't think it's a serious injury. It's just one of those where you think if he gets another, if he gets smashed again or something, then uh, it might become a serious injury. A gumbo here showing his strength and speed down the left. He's pretty mobile for a centre back, but he can also play left back as a another position. Gilby's cross is cut out. McAtee inside, followed by Van Kooten. Going to drop off a little bit. Good interception. And there's just a minute left to go. Oh, that's a poor pass. But Roberts retrieves it. Roberts. Inside. And here's Reeves. And a good chance here. Reeves just... Yes! It's going to go in. Reeves. And you know what? This guy has been superb today. He's been really, really good for us. It's a good shout to give Bosbrick a rest. Taylor in um, defensive mid, and then to the right of him, Jake Reeves, to the left, Alex Gilby. And this guy has been a really, really good addition to the midfield. A gumbo's going to throw it long. Flicked on, but not far enough. And that is full time. Um, I think that's as straight forward as you're going to get. You know, in terms of performance, in terms of everybody doing their jobs. A couple of scares here and there, but for the most part, Grimsby has swept aside. And sure, absolutely positive, we won't get too carried away because we will get tougher tests than this on, on the road and obviously in the season. But job done and looking very, very solid in the early, early goings. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, good quality goals and uh, yeah, great result. Alright guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, smash the like button, leave a nice comment for me and let me know what you're enjoying so far. When we come back, we're going to be playing Hartlepool away in the league. Should be a good game. I'll see you in a couple of days and hopefully we continue this great start to the season. This is our lad for Set Play Gaming. I'll see you guys real soon.